Hello guys and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today in this tutorial we will see how to change the settings of IDLE that is how to change the font style or font size of the text which we use to write the program that is this or how to change the theme of IDLE etc. So if you want to change the font size or font style you should go to here this option okay if you click on this button here you can see configure ideally so you click on this so here we can see a window setting window here we can see first window here is fonts and tab so you can change the font here font style font size as well as you can make it bold or regular as well as you can change the indentation width also when we are using loops or if else conditional statement when we enter like this it will give this indentation right it will give the default indentation the default indentation is four space if you want to change that you can do that here right you can change that here so here we can see different fonts you can choose any one like this and you can change the font size here you can click any number here like this and you can give apply and ok and here we can see the font style and font size is changed here ok in this way you can change the fonts or the font size here in the first tab next tab is highlights so you can change the theme here that is here we can say ideally classic now theme is ideally classic if you go ideally dark here we can see this is the theme you can see the dark theme so if you open the new file here we can see ok you can write here program ok in this way you can change the theme of the ideally here if you want you can change the highlighting colors also for example here we can see to represent the keywords in the python here we can see orange color right so now if you want to change that here you can do that here you need to go to the highlights so you need to first select this normal code or text here i'll take python keywords i need to change the color of python keywords next here choose color for so here i'll take this color for the keywords and give ok and here you need to give a name to this new custom theme so i'll give name as a ok now here we can see theme is selected as a if i apply here we can see the the color of keyword is changed here so in this way you can change the highlight text color now if you want to change this settings to default default setting then you can go here configure ideally and here in the highlights here we can see a built-in theme or custom theme here here now a custom theme is selected so you here you can go to the built-in theme and apply okay here we can see here we can see the default setting now and if you want to remove this custom theme you can click on this and here delete custom theme yes apply ok ok the custom theme will be removed or deleted like this so here using this you can change the font style or font size or indentation width or you can select the dark theme or the light theme and you can write the program okay so this is about the few settings of ideally so that's it for now guys thank you for watching don't forget to subscribe to my channel i will meet you in next class till then take care